everyone, Abby here, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new. Today I'm gonna to be reviewing the Lululemon All Night Festival Bag 5 Liter, as requested by one of you. But before I get started, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you can stay tuned to all my new videos dropping weekly, and so you can help the channel grow. So I have this bag in the color Fragment Camo Jacquard Black Deep Coal. So this bag currently goes for $78, guys, which is the same price as the newly released All Night Festival bag Zip Top. I have done a full review on that one and a bit of a comparison as well. So if you are interested in that bag, you can find that on the top right or in the description below. All right, guys, so first off, we do have a Lululemon logo right here. It's a metal logo, my favorite to see. Super durable, looks great. And here we have a matte black logo. So now I'm gonna show you guys kind of all around and inside the bag. So this is the front of the bag here, guys. We have a little zippered pocket right here. Next, we have another zippered pocket. And you know, this little flap here is magnetic, so to kind of open it fully, you just pop that open. So here's the interior of this pocket. And it is very, very long. I mean, it could fit like this much of my arm in here. Very big, guys. And inside of here, we do have a zippered pocket. And in that zippered pocket, we have a message that says items of importance. The last pocket we have on this bag is right here. And it is a drop-in pocket. And it's pretty spacious. Coming over to the back, guys, there are no pockets. And we do have a continuous loop strap. All right, guys, so now I'm gonna go ahead and try this on so you can see what it looks like on me. All right, guys, so here's what it looks like on me as a crossbody. And you can definitely wear it low like this, or you can tighten it up and wear it kind of right across your chest. So to tighten the strap, guys, you are just going to kind of pull on this side and then pull on the other. And this is a continuous loop, so it's super easy to adjust. All right, so I've tightened it up, and now it's right across my chest. And one thing to note is that it does lie pretty flat against you, but it does stick out a little bit. I definitely really like to wear it like this. Um, you know, it allows your hands to be free and you can just keep everything in your middle, nothing weighing you down one side or the other. So another way you can wear this bag is as a traditional purse. So here it is as a purse. Just throwing it over my shoulder here. And this is the longest it goes, guys. And you can go ahead and tighten up the strap to whatever length you want, really. I'm gonna tighten it about halfway. And this is what that looks like about halfway on me. So another way you can wear this bag is as a belt bag. So depending on the length of your waist, you might be able to wear it as a belt bag or you might not. Um, it does work pretty well for me. So again, I am a size 10 in Lululemon bottoms, typically a 12 in their tops. The final way you can wear this bag is as little like clutch. So you can go ahead and remove the straps with these carabiners and then you can just hold it. All right, guys, I hope you did find it helpful seeing me try this on today. And now I'm gonna go into the major highlights about this bag. So it's great for shopping, walks, amusement parks, travel, and casual wear. It's made of a water repellent fabric that's easy to wipe clean. It's a five liter capacity bag, and this is very spacious, guys. You can definitely hold all of your essentials and a lot more. The dimensions of this bag are nine inches by five inches by eight inches. And it has an adjustable strap and I've gone ahead and measured the strap out for you guys and I have the maximum and minimum strap lengths on screen for you. It also has a removable strap and you can wear this bag multiple ways. All right guys, so here's the tag for anybody interested in this information here. All right guys, so now I'm gonna show you what this bag can hold. You know what I would typically put inside of my bag. So I have gone ahead and grabbed some supplies. So typically I like to put my phone in this little drop-in pocket and I have the dimensions of my phone on screen for you guys if you're interested. So I'm gonna put like a pen in here. Um, sometimes I'd put like pens, pencils, highlighters, depending on where I'm going. And I'm gonna go ahead and put a little sanitizer in here as well. So now coming over to this interior pocket, you can put a pair of sunglasses in this pocket. It's kind of the perfect size for them. So, I'm gonna go ahead, I have a little mini wallet right here. I have a hand lotion, I'm gonna put those in. I also have a mask, I'm gonna put that in here. I even have a book, guys, and it is going to fit in here. 
So the next thing we could put in here is a water bottle. So I have a standard 500 milliliter water bottle. All right guys, so another thing it could fit is a pair of gloves. All right guys, so here's everything that's in here. Now I'm gonna go ahead and zip everything shut. And here it is full, guys. So even though it's full, it doesn't look, you know, super full. <laughs> like it doesn't bulge out in any weird ways. And you can't really see any of the items inside, which is something I really like. Some other bags you can see like, you know, indents of the items. So as you guys can see, we are pretty packed in here. So if you wanna be able to use the bag normally and be able to, you know, clip it shut, I, I would stop there. However, if you're okay with using the bag vertically, you know, flipping it up like this, you have a lot more storage. And when you do have a vertical, guys, you could fit an entire wine bottle in here. I have here a wine bottle, standard size. You can fit a full wine bottle in here, guys, with room to spare. So now I'm gonna be doing a quick comparison between the All Night Festival Bag Micro and the All Night Festival Bag 5 Liter. So there's a $10 difference between these bags, or there was when they were for sale. So this one was 68, this was 78. So honestly, for an extra $10, you get a lot more space here, guys, which is fantastic. Just in terms of like design and everything, they are basically the exact same. We're just seeing, you know, a micro, a smaller version here. We still have that same design, that same magnet closure. Just showing you guys kind of an overlap here. So we can see that the five liter version is a lot bigger than the micro. One major difference to notice, guys, is that on the All Night Festival Bag 5 liter, the strap here is removable with these carabiners, but on the micro version here, the straps are not removable. And all right, guys, if you do want a bit more information about the All Night Festival Bag Micro, I have done a full review on that, which you can find in the top right or in the description below. All right, guys, so now I'm gonna go into the cons about this bag. So first off, this bag attracts pet hair, lint, crumbs, you name it, like crazy. And it's kind of annoying because you constantly have to wipe down your bag or lint roll it. So you guys can probably see there's bits of cat hair, you know, probably on my bag, even on the inside here. Um, yeah, it just it attracts that super easily no matter what you do. And the other con I found is the zippers, guys. So the zippers are a little bit stiff. So sometimes they do catch and it's a little bit slow to close them. It works, but yeah, it's just sometimes they catch and it's a little bit annoying. Um, I do want to say that it's just this zipper. The other ones are very solid. All right, guys, so considering the price, the quality, the color, the functionality, the capacity, and everything like that, I would go ahead and give this a 9.1 out of 10. And I definitely do give it a thumbs up. So if you guys are interested in getting the Lululemon All Night Festival Bag 5 liter, I do have the link for that in the description as well. And that's all I have for today, guys. I hope you did find this helpful. And if there's anything I missed that you wanna know, just go ahead and drop a comment below. Thanks for watching guys and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.